How's it going everybody? Today we're going to be tying an extra short body crappie jig. Sometimes you don't have a ton of chenille and you want to tie the most jigs possible with what you have so you shorten the body. So I'm going to show you a cool way to do that with this short body pattern. So for this one we're going to start with a 1 16th ounce jig head. I powder painted this with pink. We're going to use a black UTC ultra thread, 70 denier, and take that from the head about halfway to the point of the hook. For the tail we're going to be using one chartreuse marabou feather. So just start your fingers at the stem and run those up to the end of the feather to straighten the fibers. And then we're going to measure that out. We want it to be about the length of the hook. It's going to look pretty long just because the body's so short, but it's going to be about the same length as usual. So just pinch that there on the hook and then you can tie it down, give it about four or five really tight wraps and then you can let go and tie it down the rest of the way. Then you can trim the butt end off the feather and clean the fluffy areas with your thread. Just go over that as many times as you need to. Then bring your thread back down to where we tied in the tail. For the body we're going to be using some black rayon chenille. This is a nice fat chenille. Bring your thread back up to the head and then we can tie the tag end of that chenille right there at the head and bring the rest of the chenille back down to the tail. Make sure it's tied down nice and tight. Then bring your thread back up to the head once again. Then you can wrap that chenille. With this jig you only need like four or five wraps of chenille where normally you would need like eight or nine. So just keep nice tight turns pressed against the last. Use the rotary function of your vise as you need to if you have that. And then just tie down the chenille super tight. Four or five good turns should do it. And you can clip off the tag end. And now we're going to whip finish. So just do a four or five turn whip finish. Pull your thread tight and clip it off. So as you can see it's a really nice clean jig. This one's perfect for anybody who's low on chenille. Like I said this saves a lot of material. You could save up to half the material that you normally do. So it's a nice cost effective way of doing it and it definitely catches just as many fish. Now I'm going to get it wet to show you what it looks like. So there you have it. You have a nice short body. Sometimes the fish even prefer a short body for some reason. I don't really know why. Maybe it's just because they don't see it as often, but whatever it is, it works. So if you're low on supplies or if you just want to try something new, give this one a shot. I'm sure you'll be happy with it. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to like and subscribe.